Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. My name is Cordant. We are back for some more Warhammer 40k Rogue Trader. So, we just had our celebration, which did not go very well. And I think we're trying to go back to the Void Ship. It's been a few days since I've played the game, to be honest. Uh, I was busy with some other stuff. Uh, I'm trying to remember exactly where we were. Did I mention that my, my formation was kind of messed up. Is it good like this? Make your eyes bleed no, the formation is messed up. Uh, I think if you move around the position of the portraits up here, the formation gets messed up. Let me just fix this before I start this off. Um, and I think I would like something like... Like U3 over here. And then I can have my officers in the back. Okay, I like that. It's about time. And we have these purple clouds, which... Did you think you had one enemy mine? Aurora's ghost. You vanquished Twilight, you cut down Aurora, but she was only one of us. You hear me? Hmm. So this is a manifestation of the warp, I imagine. From the depths of dead stone, from his prison of cold metal, he will rise. The hour is nigh. Ooh. Oh, that it? Okay. I won't so, some kind of weakness. warp entity is... I don't know, creating these manifestations and controlling these people, I'm guessing. I'm not sure if there are enemies in the region, or... My little voices have quietened down. They're lying low, whispering somewhere in the distance. Like a draught sighing through... Yeah, sighing through the smallest crack. I suppose I should see it as a bad sign, but it's so nice to hear myself think again. Well, I'm happy for you, Edita. None shall stand in my way. Oh, okay, so yeah, I guess the best way to refresh my memory as to what I'm doing is... By looking at the log. So we want to reach the, um, the starport. There is somebody over here, damn it. Oh! Oh, that was... quick. We have a bunch of enemies here. Uh, a lot of them are very <clears throat> weak. 19 HP. The Chaos spawn could potentially be a problem. I'm not really in a very good position. Naturally, I will want Abelard to be in the front to, you know, take care of the Chaos Pawn. But he's gonna be very exposed as well. Firestarter, Anointed Cultist. I think he should be good still. Okay, so you can go over there. And let's see. You can stay like over here. I'm, this is not cover, which is unfortunate. Only cover is over here or there. I would love for her to go over there. And I think I'll start just moving her over there as well. I have to seize the initiative as well, before I forget. So I can actually do some damage. Before... Um, before having to worry too much about this. I got a comment saying that my main character looked like... The... Um, the face you get in the Half-Life intro. And you know what? He's right. It does look like the guy from the Half-Life intro. <laughs> Very weird thing to, to remember, but it is true. Okay, you can go over there. <clears throat> and I'm only missing Idira. So Idira can come over here. And yeah, we're all out of cover, which I don't appreciate, but... Let's see what we can do. Okay. So, you can go over here. Oh, damn. There's... Okay, this is bad. Okay, this is very bad. Um... I'm not sure how to take care of this. I'm thinking about Argenta over here. To try and deal damage over here and deal damage over there once they start coming in. <clears throat> Uh, yeah, the positionings are gonna be strange, is all I'm gonna say. 
Now, Edita could probably straight up kill one of these, but not much else. So I'm thinking about maybe giving the extra turn to Argenta right now. Okay, I'll do that. So Argenta, take an extra turn. Veil degradation is already quite high, which is very bad for us. And Edita is, uh, is kind of in the way. She is kind of in the way. So, do I just damage... Do I just damage the Chaos Spawn? 100% chance to hit, is this true? Or are these all filthy, dirty lies? Okay, so 1 AP for Concentrated Fire, plus 2 for Burst is 3, plus Run and Gun is 4. Plus burst is 5, she would take willpower damage or she can also shoot again. Okay, I'll go for it. Probably should have done this with run and gun to try and mitigate the effect of winded, but I'll just go with it for now. Okay, so let's... Yeah, because if I want to try and hit these guys, I'm always shooting Yadira. But if I do this, I can over-penetrate and deal damage to the guys behind him. Okay, go. Oh. This 100% chance was a little bit strange, wasn't it? It felt strange to me. I'm not sure. Maybe, maybe it's my problem. I don't know. I'll do it. <laughs> I'm not surprised, however. I am not surprised. So what if I come over here? Still can't really do much. I can try to shoot this one. Or just keep putting pressure here. I'll try shooting... How much HP? 43, 19... I think I'll just try and shoot him again. What is up with this, man. <clears throat> okay. So, Cassia, you can stay where you are. Or you can come over here in case I want to use the eye thingy on the enemies. My turn. I'm thinking if I want to give Argenta an additional turn or if I want to give it to Idira so she can buff up a little bit our people or even Cassia honestly I think I'll go for Idira Not a problem for me Okay we do have to be careful about this, though. Okay, so let's try and maximize damage for... ...sharing of the damage here. Okay... It hit him, which is unfortunate, but it is what it is. And we're gonna buff our friend Abelard. Okay. Stop it. Yep, that's expected. Now Cassia plays again. Cool. Now what do I want Cassia to do here? I think I will try and buff Idira. I'm I'm afraid she's gonna blow herself up. But I still think it might be the best choice. If I may. So take that. Take I this. Am a and take an extra turn. I'm not accustomed to being ordered around. Okay. And can I reach this guy? I can. I can deal a lot of damage as well. Oh, I can also reach these two. This guy is a fire starter. Okay, I think I, I think I prefer going for those still. So I will put exploits there. And we're going to kill both of these. 
Okay, good. Dealt some damage here as well. And I can buff, for example, Argenta. <clears throat> and heal yourself up. This is what I was afraid of. <clears throat> can I... Don't... Oh my god, man. Mmm, wonderful. That's... That's an order. Wonderful. Well, let's see if we can still do this. But it's it's looking grim. I will try. I will try. So. Uh, I don't really like getting too close right now. It might lead to some big problems. Let me see. I can do this. I can give everybody some armor. If possible. And buff us all up while debuffing these two. Okay, and I think you're just gonna stay where you are. Fine. I don't think I'm gonna be able to take Idita out of harm's way. I can try and taunt them. So I would go over here and do a brace for impact. I've seen worse battles than this in my time. Okay. How much damage am I dealing here? I'm dealing 15, uh, 11 to 15 if I go for my chain sword, 7 to 9. Okay. So I would like to do this first. I will do, thank you. Okay, everybody's taunted. Let's go for Sworn Enemy. I think I need to kill this guy quickly. Victory is imminent. Because I do believe... Yeah, the people down there are also part of the current fight. So I cannot avoid them. Just smack the guy. It will be done. Of course. Endure. Let's see what they do. It's fine. <laughs> 46 aftershock damage, lovely. Okay, so Idira is still alive. Man, but this is rough. She has two traumas. I lost Argenta. I can heal her up a little bit. And then what do I do? Try and deal as much damage as possible on other people like that guy? This would cost me... No, that's that's too much AP. So I think I'll just try and heal. We'll do. <laughs> okay, well, that doesn't work. That does not work at all. Man, this, this veil thing is very annoying. Very, very annoying. Okay, first of all, you serve me. That's my biggest source of damage right now. And I think I'll give you voice of command. <clears throat> Head of authority. Take an extra turn. Buff yourself up. Isn't this a job for the serfs? Really? I can't... I can't stun this bitch. What about like this? Why isn't this guy in the way as well? Okay, all well, this works. Step aside. The navigator is coming. Mm. Are you stunned? Say you're stunned. Come on. Not stunned. This guy's stunned at least, okay. So, I guess you take this. I think we're dead. I think we're actually just straight up dead here. My tactics are flawless. I 
don't see a way out of this. Yeah. I need to do everything myself. I can probably deal a lot of damage still with the people I have, but... Well, again, I I'll try, and we're gonna see how this goes, but my faith in this fight is... It's not looking good. To say the least. We are gonna try and stack up as much tactical knowledge as possible by just hitting this one. We are up to 11. And I guess I would want to deal AoE damage here. Uh, bitch moved. I'm not very really concerned about Abelard. Although he will die eventually. Sworn enemy. Do I need to move for this? I don't. Okay. I also don't get it because I think I taunted this guy, but he ignored Abelard. I have to use Endure anyway. Okay. Well, Abelard is doing a good job of tanking at least, but <laughs> those guys are starting to come in. Okay, Pascal. I'm gonna keep giving Pascal everything I have. Right, I don't think I have any choice in the matter. So take that. Do I care about this? No. Alright, so. Let's. Pump you up. Four. Remove these. Go again. Okay. And what do we lose? The officer's fellowship is halved. Ah, I don't think I want that. Let's move back a bit. Suits my purposes. Good. <laughs> this is gonna be a long fight. Oh, these bitch heals? Aha, <laughs> parried. That's horrible. <laughs> this is a very smart enemy. He's not just going for the people in front, he's going for the actual important targets. Okay, then well played, well played, I will say. Well played. Request approved. I will make you bleed. Good. But yeah, Avalard is not gonna <laughs> he's not gonna be able to take this. Oh come on. I can't find a way to hit them both. Okay, well I guess I'm gonna start with maybe her. She has less HP. That can happen. I'd rather not. I'm not interested. Can I target? No. Victory is imminent. Okay, enemies, do your worst. I've suffered worse. Would you say this is a good fight for me? I would say probably not, right? Dude, if you don't live through this, I have no real chance of winning this battle whatsoever. So please, don't die. 
Okay, just keep stacking those bonuses. We have a good chance to hit. Good. And let's try and minimize damage coming out of her. But yeah, I have to make Abelard... I have to make them focus on Abelard. Okay, it's a good thing that I can actually try and do that. Did it work? Not on this one. Which is unfortunate. I will do like you He's taunted. I'm gonna try and reach this guy. Although I am gonna take a tax opportunity, naturally. But I would like him to focus on me. Okay. <clears throat> Just focus on him. My ears are I'm speeding up the enemy's turn to make this go a little bit faster. But this is becoming a little bit silly. Man, she does so much damage. And I think she even had a debuff. Okay. Well, I can analyze this guy, I suppose. 12 stacks is good. Like this. Okay. Try and target all of these. Very decent damage. <clears throat> I can hit them all. So let's make this... No, I'm gonna save... So, two, three, four. Yeah, never mind. So Endure is something we have to have. I should also probably heal. But... Hopefully we can kill this bitch here. Victory is imminent. Of course not. I can do this. What is my penalty? Uh, can't use charge and MP is reduced by 3. I'll take it. <clears throat> so, we're gonna cost this. I will do my duty. And go for a desperate measure. We'll rule the stars Additional turn. Okay, she's dead. Good. And let's use the remaining action points to heal up. Very good. I like where you are right now. Well. Let's keep going. Abelard carrying the team. As long as they don't kill Pascal. Wait, what is... There's a fire-starting cultist over there? How? Okay, I think I wanna... Oh, man, the cover is in the cloud area. Okay. How does this look? This looks like a lot of damage. Okay, I think I like that. Uh, wait, how much? 47 damage. 54 to 66. I think it's because of my tactical knowledge <clears throat> that I'm doing so much damage. Three, six... Can I catch this guy alone? No, I, I can only catch them all. So I guess I'll put it on this guy. Here. And tactical knowledge only on him. Up to 44 armor. Uh, I would like to get out of line of sight of this guy. Can I still throw my grenade from over here and hit everybody? I can't hit the guy over there, but that's mostly fine for me. Oh! Okay, this way I don't hit Abelard. Do it! Do it! 
That is very nice. Very, very nice. <clears throat> okay, just don't die, my friend, okay? Just don't die. That's all I need. And we hit here. Indeed. Good job. And we taunt once again. And we endure. Do your worst. Yeah, the chaos pawns, I don't know why, but they're not threatening at all. Famous last words, right? Okay, well, Pascal goes again. I will stick with what works. Analyze. Tactical knowledge. What is our armor looking like? 140% armor. Okay, I like it. How much do you deal? Oh, 94 to 100 damage. But this allows me to hit everybody and not hit Abelard. So I think I want that. Yeah. Well, this is why we have them. Perfect. <clears throat> now we can focus on him. I still have those to contend with, but those are kind of just whatever. So take Sworn Enemy, take a strike in the face for not a lot of damage. Uh, take Endure, and I'm gonna taunt him again just to make sure he's not gonna go for Pascal. Pass the turn. Thank you. Okay. Yourself, We're back. Do this. Do that. And that's a very decent shot. Uh, if I would go instead for an overcharge, 77 to 81. It's the same thing. What? Deal 70%, 75% extra damage, yet overheats the weapon for two turns. It, it still says the damage is the same damage. Which I, I think it's just a, a UI uh, glitch, I guess. Just shoot him. <clears throat> okay. Might as well just reload my weapon here. And... Pass. Sworn. Endure. Strike. Good. Taunt. Good. Pass. You can shoot me all you want. That's not as good, though. Right? Pascal, let's go. I think I'll just shoot him like this, keep my... Oh! Holy crap. Okay. Well, let's hope this hits. <laughs> I'm happy. Um, precise attack. For the next attack against target effect my exploit, that target's cover efficiency will be reduced. And additional hit chance. Yes, I will take that. And might as well do this. Oh, this guy is praying. He might turn into a chaos spawn as well, but that's mostly fine with me. It will be done. Oh, dude, come on. Dude, taunt. One HP. Grenade. Okay, well, he has one HP. I would like to use my my shot on someone else and have Abelard kill him. Not sure if I'm gonna have the chance to, you know, do whatever I want in that regard, though. Um, can I shoot somebody down there from where I'm standing? I actually can. 80% hit chance. That's quite good. 
Sure. 170 damage. Uh -huh, I'll take it. Let's try and make things a little bit easier for Abelard to kill the guy by using Exposed Weakness. And go again for the size attack. Yeah, okay. Exposed Weakness is doing a, a very good job here. That guy... I think I'll probably kill with Pascal. So I'm just going to move over here. Do that. Endure. Well. Hello, my friend. <laughs> we can basically one-shot demons right now. Okay. Um, recast this because why not? Precise strike. Pass. Yeah, remember we cannot charge because we used our desperate measure, but it's fine. We're gonna swap our weapon and burst this guy down. Actually, uh, do this first. Tried and tested tactics are the best Before I forget. Q, 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 Q. Awesome shots. Endure. Taunting. Well, I guess this is a showcase for the power of Pascal, I imagine. Or just generally speaking for um, operatives. They can deal insane amounts of damage if the game goes long enough, or the combat goes long enough. Look at this. Easy fight! Nobody went down! Victory awaits. I was never concerned. Was any, anybody worried here? Was anybody worried? Be honest. You can leave your comments saying that you were worried. I won't believe it because you, you were never worried. My whispers crave. And why do you have a fresh injury? How did you just get a fresh injury right now? I don't really understand how that was possible, but okay. Oh, what is this? What is that? The wielder of this staff, power level 9, Gains the vision of death abilities. Okay. I think I have to equip it to see it. How may I serve the dynasty? So this is Ah, heroic and desperate, okay. The target must pass a willpower resistant test. If the test fails, the target suffers psychic staff power level, so it's nine. Plus the Psyker Psy rating 2, so 11, plus 30% of the target's current wounds, mental damage. If the test succeeds, the target instead suffers Psyker Stav, power level, mental damage. Um, Veil degradation increased by plus 1. It seems good, but I don't think it is. If it were the maximum wounds, it could be useful, but this just means that it, it gets lower and lower importance it's a good boss killer weapon i guess if they fail the test naturally what about heroic act version there's no save ah and desperate this psychic power always triggers perils of the warp if the test is the psychic also suffers some damage yeah this this nah, nah, nah. i like my palpatine thingy the only thing I'm sad about is that this stuff gives me plus 10 willpower, while this one only gives me plus 5. But I like my lightnings, so I will try and keep stars. using those. Um, oh, oh, oh. Okay, what is this? Oh, it's a statue. Uh, 
Am I gonna fight A more enemies? I would really me. not like to fight more enemies. This is just the beginning enemy mine. She's just scaring me. I have to go around. Yeah, if I had to guess, I will say there's at least one more combat encounter before we're through. That would be my bet. No? Just one? They are coming. One following in the other's footsteps. The aurora of the morning and the aurora of the evening. The aurora of the morning and the aurora of the evening. Okay. It's about time. Well, it really is just one... Uh, camera. Just one combat encounter. Well, we have our void ship in the starport, but we're all heavily traumatized right now. <laughs> but we're alive. And as long as we're alive, we're gonna keep going. I don't want to reload. The, okay, so first of all, we have to find the shuttle. The anarchy on the starport will distress the hallowed machine spirits of the Voidcraft, rendering them deaf to all litanies of placation. The shuttle we use for the evacuation must be handled with caution. Not sure what exactly that means for us, but... Where am I? Obscure glyphs have been scrawled on the rock creek. Their natural shapes are physically repulsive. None shall stand in my way. We have this lift here, which I think we used before to open up that thingy. Yep. We did. Submit, what? And you'll die quickly. I've been ambushed. Yeah. Wonderful. By what? Okay. Uh, weak group over here. Ugh, they have sharpshooters. There are not many, though. At least not that I can see. Well, I cannot position, so I just have to go with it. Cassia. It would be cool if I could do something... Oh, no, never mind. This is my seize the initiative turn, so I can't actually do much here. We have line of sight for everyone, and we're also under heavy cover. Which is a good thing. I think I will just start buffing my friends. Okay, I'm gonna buff Edita here. Emperor, give me strength. Take air of authority, me. give us some momentum. If you insist, Lord Captain. And if you came over here, what's the difference? Not much. So you just just stay where you are. Or this is actually no cover. No, I think I would prefer to have Argento over here. So just get over here instead. I have read tomes of military tactics. Now my character, you can go under half cover, I suppose. And I think I will just buff Abelard here. Forge ahead! These sharpshooters, I imagine, are going to be a pain for me right now. I think somebody got shot, but for very low damage. Just a yeah, th this is the... Or these are the dangerous enemies. <sighs> too much for, me. for exactly that reason. And we are very far away, which is something that I don't like at all. Okay. The chances are kind of crappy, man. Okay, I'll, I will still go for it. So, concentrated fire. And I, I do really believe that Argenta is probably better off having a sniper rifle in the offhand. Or in the other weapon set for these situations here. But I'm kind of committed with the bolter right now, so I'll just keep using it. Um, what is better? This, I suppose. Okay. I was kind of counting on you, Argenta. I really was. Let's just entrench. Doubt is for the weak. Okay, they're moving. Thank you. 
Idira. How far can you hit people? Not far enough. Man, I really want to move my characters up, but I... I, I can't. I will just be very exposed if I do. I think I'll just try and heal Cassia. Uh, okay, let me just give her some extra toughness. What, of course. Heal up. Get some dodge chance. Was, was that you? Okay, and what? I think we can just, for right now, chill over here. And after we have Abelard more in the front, we're gonna start moving in. I know what is to come. Okay, Abelard. Let's give everybody brace for impact. Well, everybody in range, I suppose. And... I will just try to rush the sharpshooters as much as I can. So something like this, and then just charge in. Get closer. Over there. Oh, that's... The success. Bad. And I thought I still had the med kit, but I, I don't have it, and I can't equip it, right? I no, I cannot. That sucks. <sighs> okay, taunt the sharpshooter. Will be done. Sworn enemy on this guy. Victory Endure. And I can even still shoot somebody. Let's see if I can hit some of these. Nice! Very nice. Okay. So this is trapped. Good to know. 58% chance to hit. Is not terrible. And I think that's what I have to do, honestly. Let's try and... Buff our gent a little bit. Nothing I can't do. Because I feel like she's going to have to start moving. Easy. And shoot this guy if we can. Already done. Oh, Another very good. Strike. Very, very good. So how are we looking buff-wise? She has a fresh injury, which we cannot heal right now. Unless I gave like our... Well, we have so many traumas at this point that I don't think I can. I'm <laughs> I don't think it matters too much. Um, I will buff herself to get some more HP. Uh, she has air of authority. This guy has nothing, so you can take these. I am a navigator, not a servitor. And you can stay where you are. And Pascal. You can't really do much. But you can start moving forward. Ish. Ooh, I might be able to kill this guy. Okay, okay. So wait. Do this. Move over here. Exploit. Precise attack. I think I'll just go for the AoE. Nice. Okay, round two. Bitch. Sorry, you know, you know that sometimes I have to check this again because I get very lost on this. Uh, wait, uh, is it this one? No, no, this one does not stack with itself. 
I wonder if she has, if this is now working based on a recent patch. But if it says it does not stack with itself, does it mean... It should mean that it only gives her one more AP. Because she got voice of, voice of command plus air of authority, that would be two. Plus the buff from voice of from air of authority, and that would make seven. But I will only believe it when I when I have some more proof. I think. God Emperor, move through me. Be the fire in my heart. Ah, oh, come on. As the Emperor commands, I act. You got this, woman. This shouldn't be difficult. I'll do it. <laughs> How did she? She didn't get injured. Okay. Uh, whatever. As the Emperor commands. Hey, we're doing something. Um, this doesn't really matter too much. Oh, maybe it was be because I used in trench. Sometimes I get lost. Um, she no longer has a fresh injury, I believe. Oh, she does. Let's. Uh, I can't even heal that. Never mind. So, Idira. Eh, still, just do it. I think. We'll do. There's not much else she can do. She can move up, there but that's it. In the Take that. On it. Uh, uh, uh. Okay, Avalard. We are gonna start moving closer to that bitch by charging and po possibly stepping on traps. But <clears throat> okay, we're good. I will do my duty. Okay, can I find line of sight? I actually can. You got this! No? I did hit. Uh, let's just... Oh, let's do this. Nothing I can't do. Heal again. Doesn't help either of them. Okay. Pass, pass. Uh, you don't really have to do anything either. So just, I guess, take that. Isn't this a job for the serfs? If I may. Okay. How does she still have a fresh injury? I'm not really understanding that. I thought that a, a turn had passed already. I can remove his fresh injury, I think. Nice. Okay, <clears throat> so pass and pass. Yeah, still fresh. Wait a second. It's still an unfair. It's still only one round before a fresh wound becomes an old wound. I don't know what's happening here. I feel like I should have a, an old wound by now. Searching is my <clears throat> can I shoot from here? I can. Okay, so take that. Uh, oh. Activate calculus fury Good job. I forgot to use this. Damn it. Approved. Okay. Uh, Argenta, it doesn't really matter too much. She, she doesn't have line of sight. So just, just whatever, just stay there. I will try and heal you again, because reasons. Will do. What is this foreboding? Uh, Abelard. 
You can go over here and then charge over there. Yes. A tactically sound. Oh god damn it. Well we got some injuries, but there's they're all fresh. Yes. I don't know what's happening. It's so strange. And I, I, I sincerely do apologize I if I'm the if I'm just missing I'm your some mechanics. I feel like I'm saying this a lot, but there Should have I been so many bugs mistake? in the game thus far was, that I was that you? maybe this is something or, that's intended. I'm just missing it. I, I, I don't know. Sins uh, but I feel like those fresh Never injuries should have become old wounds. Um, the trap dealt damage to cover, but not to hurt. The Emperor favors me today. Whatever. The burden of failure Try again. is the most terrible punishment. I better myself through my okay. service. Every one of the dead have had their eyes ruthlessly burned. I won't tolerate weakness. I'm trying to find traps or hidden treasure. Right there. Okay, that's one. Never doubt me. An entire procession of cargo servitors was destroyed by gunfire. Not a single one of them attempted to flee. A new challenge for me. A sniper rifle. I would think that this area is no longer trapped because this is the where the stars. enemies were. What do you mean goods? What the hell? I'll take it, but what was here? There was nothing there. <laughs> Alright. Whatever. Okay, so we have a plasma gun, which I imagine is better than the plasma pistol. Yep, it is. It has more range, it has a recoil of 30, more damage, more armor penetration, it's two-handed. Plasma single shot, plasma area of attack, and plasma overcharge for extra damage. Sure, it's a strict upgrade, so take it. Okay. We have a guard here. The turret was placed in a great hurry, but the Technomat never had a chance to activate it. Okay, I feel like we're going the same Follow way we were before. Lead. Is there something new in here? Stop sniveling recruit, you're addressing a rogue trader. Your Lordship, permission to report. We've been posted to guard the field infirmary. The Governor and Sergeant Malgar are over at the landing pants, planning the evacuation. Okay, so this is now the infirmary, I imagine. Captives. We're all gonna die here, just like that, while the nobles evacuate. We're all gonna die. Judging by the caustic smell and oily stains, Promethium was previously stored here. It must have fallen into the hands of the heretics. Victory awaits! Okay, and apparently this is... Oh, this reminds me. I have to... I have to do this. Uh, help. Help, friends. Ah, here. You are going to take some extra grenades because they were very handy. And who else can use medkits? You have one. Uh, you cannot use them. You have one. You have one. And you have none. Okay. A machine god grants the insight. Meh. Okay. None shall stand in my way.
the game just auto saved and if memory serves I think something's gonna happen here <laughs> so what we're gonna do my friends is we are actually gonna we end our episode right here I believe there's gonna be a big encounter once we move into that area and I want to leave that one for a fresh episode um, because I don't want to start it now and then just, you know, finishing halfway or make this last for one hour and a half. So yeah, this will be the end of this episode, my friends. As always, I want to thank you all for being here with me in the channel, watching some Rogue Trader. Definitely a very chaotic episode, mostly due to this lady right here. You know, she, she basically messed up <laughs> the entire fight uh, that we had previously. But we got through it, uh, through the power mostly of Abelard being a... A very decent tank and you know our operative Pascal doing a lot of damage very proud of that it was actually a good chance to test out uh, these two characters and their builds I feel like they're working quite nicely uh, I might give Argenta a different kind of weapon set she has this in case somebody gets too close to her but it's not really been happening all that much and I think she might benefit more from having a sniper rifle instead of these here because this doesn't really cut it in in the very long range uh, but i will think about that before i start the next episode and then i'm gonna decide um but yeah as always if you guys have any questions or suggestions leave a comment below if you are enjoying the content consider subscribing for more many more videos coming out soon and i hope to see you all in the next episode until then stay safe everyone